Private garbage collectors under the Waste and Environment Management Association of Kenya took to the streets with their garbage trucks in tow. Never mind the stench following in their wake, they had every intention of sending their message home. And to do so, they made their way from Westlands through Uhuru Highway into the central business district where they have been barred from operating, if only to have their voices heard. Tunaandamana kwa sababu tunaona tunadhulumiwa hakuna haki kazi zetu tunalazimishwa tuna tufunge tunalazimishwa kuuza kazi zetu kwa watu wengine ambao hawajakuwa kwa hii biashara Tunataka historia ifikie urezo ajue sisi mayuti hatuna hata hizo virae unaona tunabeba hata hii takataka na mkokoteni na ndio kukomba na ndio kukomboa at the heart of the matter are claims that the Nairobi County government is monopolizing garbage collection in the city. First, they say, was a directive in March this year that pushed them out of the CBD. Then followed another directive on the 3rd of October 2014 that they stop operations in Kileleshwa, Kilimani, Lavington, Kangemi and other parts of Westlands. Instead, another company was awarded the tender. The private garbage collectors sought audience with Nairobi Governor Evans Kedero to question the rationale of awarding contracts to select companies. Mimi, si kujua mna kuja lakini vile ni meona mefika, mimi ni taongea na njini, na zile tabu ambayo mnazo, tutasuluisha. 30 minutes later and... Tutandika barua ambapo Governor amesema, si kuya chumatatu. Iyo barua inafaa kuwa imekuwa received kwa ofisi yake. Tuwe tume eh, kila kambuni, uandike kambuni yako, how many companies, I mean the, 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 number of, uh, the, the number of companies, the number of vehicles per each company, the youth uh, uh, wale wameanchiwa kwa hiyo kambuni, na tagataka yenu mmekuwa mukidambu wapi. Now they hope that a meeting set for Tuesday will iron out the differences. Salim Bilu, Citizen Live at 9.